Officials are warning people about the Tuolumne River, which is expected to rise 11 times its current level. So exactly just how much water is being released? We're getting answers. Drone 13 flying high above the Tuolumne River in Modesto, where the water is expected to rise four to six feet in the next 24 hours. It's going to be running fast. And so it's very dangerous. The Turlock Irrigation District is warning hikers, anglers, and other visitors to stay out of the water. The water is going to be very cold uh, because uh, we, we've increased the flow. So if you get in the end of the river, uh, hypothermia can set in. But if you do go near the water, a life vest is key. If you're walking on some rocks, for example, and they're wet, you can slip off into the water. David Kiefer often fishes here with his kids. He plans to heed the warning. Wouldn't be bringing them down here when the water is that high and cold. No reason for it. He also encourages avid anglers to follow suit. If it's high and cold, it's usually not good fishing anyway. Water will be released from Don Pedro Reservoir starting Saturday as one of two annual surges required by fish and wildlife, even in a drought. This surge will release just under 2% of expected spring runoff. So what we're doing here is we're assisting the juvenile salmon to migrate out of the Tuolumne to the Delta. Before reservoirs were built, spring snowmelt would surge through the rivers. Young salmon would ride the wave down the delta and into the Pacific Ocean. So that's what we're doing here. We're kind of mimicking what happens in nature. The levels are expected to return to normal by April 25th.